struggle is still going on. The cruelty of the enemy is as great as ever. His willingness to murder, to kill, to imprison, to deny us justice is as passionate as ever. We aren't engaged in any negative protest and any negative arguments with anybody. We are saying that we are determined to be men. We are determined to be people. You were born where you were born and faced the future that you face because you were black and for no other reason. The limits of your ambition were thus expected to be settled. Can't even scroll my phone without somebody getting slaughtered. And even with our cameras up, no charges getting brought up. So as I did research, I started to look and find thinkers from different, different times and to read the language that they use and their voices. And I realized that we've been dealing with the same struggles, you know, since we've been here as a community. If we don't, if we don't find a way to like truly love ourselves first and like wipe out that, that, that lack of self-worth that's been established, then that, then that economic power can never actually truly happen. And then even the success we get in America, we only feel like we're successful because we're doing things that white people already did.